And the auto sock vehicle is going until the, the, the braking vehicle behind him with the brakes on stops. The site of the event is just outside the Eisenhower Tunnel, 11,158 feet elevation. And we've had a lot of new snow, so it's a good condition for the test. Ideal conditions for us would actually be a little slicker in this. The ideal conditions would be that we'd have very wet snow, which is the slickest condition you get, but we're working with what we've got, and we're happy we have snow. We didn't have that yesterday. What we're going to start with is on this, uh, this vehicle is the heavier vehicle. We're going to keep it in a neutral position, and we're going to take the drive axle and just go with one drive axle on this without an auto sock on it, and see what kind of force it takes before it can't pull this vehicle. Then the next test we're going to do on it is we're going to slip an auto sock on there and the one axle, the drive axle that's engaged, to see what it'll do to pull this. And then after that, we'll go to putting a chain on the single axle and see what the pull is on that with one single chain. And then we'll duplicate the whole efforts with both drive axles engaged. So we'll have two drive axles, the drive axles engaged on both without auto sock, with four auto socks on the outside on the singles on the outside and then with um, the chains on all four tires which is the requirement. The lead vehicle has actually winter tires. Give me a signal that they're starting. And the result of that first pull was 2,290 kilos, yeah. or about 2.3 tons. Okay, the pulling vehicle now has is chained up, and you can see that he has chains on both wheels in the drive field. Okay, they're going now. This is with one set of auto socks. This time we have auto shots on both drive axles. When it comes down, you watch his, watch his wheels lock. And you'll be able to scan down, you'll see he actually locks his okay. wheels. Again, they begin this with the braking vehicle in neutral. He's pulling him, he's got the signal, and then he's going to lock up his wheels. There. <laughs> the result is 4,712. Okay. Now they're putting on chains. They're going to put on two sets. We have people working on both sides.
<laughs> Wrong accent. There's a challenge to see if you can put the sock on and you don't have to have it. You want to run that extra job? No. He did the first, and after the first tire, he's running around with the other side. You can see him on the other side. He's putting the sock on the top half. Now he says he's clear. They're rolling the truck back. That's the top of the three Now he's just tightening them up. Running back around. Uh, and he's done. 50 seconds. 50 seconds. <laughs> 50 seconds. Unfortunately, he put it on the wrong axle. It should be, we're only using one set of auto sock for the very first test. Now we're seeing how fast he can take them off. Again, this is without chains or auto socks. We're currently located on the steepest part of the road that runs over the bore of the Eisenhower Tunnel. We're, this is on the north side of the tunnel. The north side of the west side of the tunnel. One more try going up. Now we have auto sock on. We're going to take the truck up, stop it, and then do a hill start. He stopped, and now he's getting going. Okay, now they're chained up and they're trying a hill start on with the chains. And it's not flying. So this is one steep, slick slope. So when the auto sock couldn't make it, neither could the chains. Interesting. They have an interesting development. The state trooper tried to get up this road with his existing tires and couldn't make it. So we're going to equip him with some auto socks and see if he can make it this time. Yeah, it'll sell center. Unfortunately, we didn't have the exact size. This is one size too large, but we're going to give it a try just to see if this will work. Okay, and now he's going to make another run. And there he goes. Stopped and actually tried to hill start. It's not, not in two. And our patrolman returns after a successful uh, round trip. He actually went up to the place where he got stuck before and did a hill stop. Hill start. Uh, the place that I tried to do a hill start without him, no problems whatsoever. And that was with overdrive off in second gear and then overdrive on in drive. 
either either one. They're oh, great. Wow. So, good.